Hey guys, so here's how I ended up in an ambulance unable to walk. I'm gonna try my best to get through this story as fast as possible. So I squatted down to zip up my suitcase and I felt a really sharp pain go through my back. So I was like, let me just get back up and go do something else. So I went into my bedroom where my husband was in case it happened again, I can explain it to him. Well, it did happen again, but this time I couldn't get back up. I was literally frozen like a statue mannequin. I could not move and not being able to move. And then also being in excruciating pain. It was like, I promise you, I've done it twice. My personal opinion, worse than giving birth. So my husband was able to pick me up and get me onto the bed into a comfortable position where the pain eased After out. the pain eased away, I felt confident that maybe I could stand up and walk it out, but no, that was not the case. My husband was literally holding me so I could walk. Like every time I stepped down, I felt a sharp pain going straight through my spine. After 15 minutes of seeing no signs of getting better, I decided to call 911 because I know for a fact that there is something wrong with my back. So the ambulance came and took me to the hospital. We all suspected I was probably sciatica, but in my head, I'm like, no, I think it's something more. I don't think it's sciatica. So they were able to run a few tests on me. They took a urine sample. They took blood tests, and then I went and got a CT scan where I found out what was wrong with me. And I was right. It is not my sciatic nerve. It is something.